There are only a few shopping days left until Christmas. And according to a Consumer Report survey, 36% of Americans are concerned about overspending this year. Overspending. Overspending. Okay, well, so where is one place you can never overspend? It's the dollar store. And here to show us some gifts you can get without breaking the bank, Megan Meany of Megan's uh, MustHaves.com. Megan, good to have you with us today. Hi, guys. So, so first, is there is there ever anybody that you should not buy a gift from the dollar store Here's for? my thinking. For maybe not for the new girlfriend that you're trying to impress, and maybe not for the mother-in-law, right? Ah, but okay. for an acquaintance who you don't want to spend a lot of money on, or a stocking stuffer, or something along those lines, yeah. why not? The office grab bag, it's a great spot. Nice. You just have to kind of have a good eye and weed through some of the stuff. But check it out, starting with a spa kit. I call this Canyon Ranch in a can. You know Canyon <laughs> Ranch, right? That fancy spa. So this is actually a waste paper basket for all of a dollar oh, cool. from the dollar store, but it's got this fun leopard print on it. So I used it as the vessel to present all these fun Bring the spa to the lady that you love. Uh, we got some washcloths, a hand towel, some powder puffs, some pretty pink candles that are scented so they can set the mood by the bathtub. And the mirror? We've got, a, yeah, the mirror is a hand mirror so you can put on your makeup and stuff, a back scratcher. Mm. We have here the mesh body scrub, right? And where's the loofah? There it is. You you can never yeah, that too was, much that's loofah. A, that's in. a good item right there. Right? Thirteen all, bucks for all of that. Nothing here is more than a dollar ninety nine. The whole thing is about thirteen dollars. Wow. All these washcloths, some crocheted headbands. Spa in a bucket. Don't you love it? Okay. And Mr. Fix It for okay. the pain in your life. So if you have, you know, a husband or an uncle or a buddy who is kind of the weekend warrior, you can pull together some great stuff from the dollar store. This is a screwdriver that has six different bits. That's a lot of bits for a buck, right? Yeah, that is. And it's got this rubber gripper. These That's are four different price. hooks. Good for anything. I was just ripping some presents okay. open with them. <laughs> Bungee cords. Maybe not big enough to put your Christmas tree on top of the but car. You but use it. usually you have to spend, I think, $10 to get four. This is a dollar for two. Can't get enough of these throwaway brushes if you're mm -hmm. testing paint, you want to see the color, you want to mix it a little bit. All these foam brushes, a dollar. And duct tape in any color you want. Also, a great value. You want to get the pressure gauge pressure so you gauge can make sure you're not spending too much money on gas if your tires are low, yeah. okay. right? You're driving Especially uh, for and wasting gas. And of course, it all goes in a bucket. Who can't use a bucket in the garage or in their tool cabinet, right? All right. Now for kids, uh, I was doubling up some for my kids, some for the show. Okay. Uh, I think my favorite thing is the wooden blocks. Now they're the most expensive thing on the table, all of $7.99, but when you find something wooden and classic like that, as opposed to plastic at the dollar store, that's a great value. So a huge tower of blocks, and we all know blocks are good, good for kids. We've got a cute little toy bus, love to inspire creativity, some sidewalk chalk with the little holder, again, dollar dollar twenty nine they've got the batman uh... coloring book my kids are really into marvel characters so that was great and a frisbee for a dollar i mean you're encouraging cool. exercise and this is a waste Ooh, basket but you know what you can use it as toy storage i love coming up with another purpose for something at the dollar store so yeah. it could be a waste cute blue waste basket or not we've she got to make sure we get to the quick. burberry Come bag on. how excited was i to find the burberry at the dollar store so for the traveler maybe grandma who's always coming to see you or someone that you know who works on the road a lot you can, they can put this in their suitcase for extra things when they're coming back, say they went shopping, okay. or use it on the airplane, texting gloves to All say, right. hey, I've arrived, picked me up. Megan, we thank you. And all these fun travel products. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you.